Lizzie Joyce, heroin addict. Heroin addict Lizzie. Tablet taker, tablet head. Listen to me, Lizzie Joyce. You're calling me names, you're calling me woman names, right? And that you're blaming me for being up there last night in your house to do that little job. I swear my two lovely little sons, my little pride and joy, who I love so much, and I wouldn't swear in them alive, I swear in them. I wasn't up around your house last night. I wasn't anywhere near your place last night to do that little job. The little job that was done last night, a little bad job, one little window broke. That was not me, Lizzie Joyce. I did not do that, Lizzie Joyce. Because if I was there, do you, know, do you remember what happened to you before when people came on top of your house and broke into your house and tried to chop you up? That's what I do. That's the job I be doing, right? The same fellas that you're terrified of your natural life of. Terrified of them that they had them up in the charges. Well, I'd have you the one way with me, Lizzie Joyce. I'd be up on top of you and I'd put my shatty down to your brains. And if I could kill you, Lizzie Joyce, I'd kill you. Because you're only a nothing but a dirty tramp. That wasn't me last night that went there and, did, and, and broke a window and ran off. That wasn't me, right? And I said already, if I was there, I'd do something else, right? But Lizzie Joyce, right? Listen to me. I'm calling names as well. Will any of your and, and will any of your sons come out and fight? Because you're all about that you're the proper Jice and need this type of blood, whatever. All the blood is in you is West blood. Do you know West is all burned in the West? That's where you're from. That's what you're from, right? All about your grandfather Davy. Davy never had a fight in his life. My grandfather Big Joe told me all about him. A quite harmless man. He'd be ashamed of his life with the grandsons and the children he's rearing. But there's not a man of Davy Jice's grandsons that beat me. There's not a man of Davy Jice's grandsons that beat any of Brian Jice's grandsons. Do you understand that? Especially Gramsci Joyce's dirt. Especially Gramsci Joyce's son Christy who I'm begging for the last three years. That won't fight. It won't fight. We'll be able to fight Rats Michael. Uh, Saturday, whatever. The Rats. The Rats wouldn't fight you anyways. But I'd fight you. Any of your sons. Davy, Joe or Christy. Any of them. If they won't fight. But they won't fight. They're only a pack of cowardly bastards. But I'm here if they are. Right? And I'm, uh, I'm badly out of shape. Trust me. Look at that look. Look at that look. 20 stone weight, I am badly out of shape. Never took the gym in weeks or months. And I'd fight you today, tomorrow, or the next day. Because you are not an only rubbish, the whole lot of you. And you, Lizzie Joyce, trust me, I wasn't there last night, but you're blaming me for being there. I live in Navin, St. Patrick's Park. Come and fucking do something if you're going to do it. Come and do something if you think you can fucking do it. Do it! Because you're, you're doing nothing to me. I'm here. I, everything I own is still here. There's nothing done to me. And you can do nothing to me. But I wasn't at your house last night, because if I was there, I'm going to shut you down through your fucking brains. Do you understand me? Right? You're fucking, you're all your eyes a name caller, a name caller, and your sons is wasters. Wasters, you're the proper Jices. Wasters, that's all you are. Wasters. Burning at Wasters, people. Proper Jices, me whole. You're good for a nod in the whole lot of you. Christy now's bet before with Joe McNeil and son Mike. And his other brother David bet with Paul and John's son Joe. Right? Lizzie's, you, Gramsley's Joe, you weren't bet, but you were bet like an ass. Right? You got your draw, but you're betting like an ass. The rest of them was bet. Right? I... Go on. Get back to me if you want to fight.